channel, so I did promise I am going to be doing a boohoo haul. That's right. So um, I'm going to what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through each item, explain a little bit about them, how I would style them, and then I'll show you them on, and I'll give my honest feedback. Sorry, change of location. You'll have to bear with me. My boyfriend's tools are in the background, but. We're rolling with it. So, I'm so excited. I always see like these influencers and different people in like flared joggers. I've never given it a go because I don't, I feel like it's made for like supermodels with like really long legs and whatever. And then I just thought, why am I being annoying? Like, so I just ordered some. And let's see how they turned out. So I got it as a matching sex. I was like, well, if I'm gonna get the joggers, I might as well get the hoodie. So. I'm in love with the colour guys. Look! I love how like elasticated it is so that it can like fit your waist. Oh my god. I'm so in love with the side. Like it's pro oh yes, please. Oh my god. So they're flared at the bottom. I'd give the colour a 10 out of 10 and I absolutely love this. I love it. I just really pray that they fit suit me. I hope. So I got a size small in these, so it was small, medium, and large. So I went with a size small. I wasn't 100% sure, but I feel like these, I went right. Hmm, I'm so excited. Um, and then this is the matching hoodie. <sighs> Can't go wrong with a hoodie and the fact that it matches as well. So just plain, this one doesn't have any contrast on the side, so I'm assuming like the joggers are like the statement of this outfit. Um, but I like the way it's cut at the bottom. It's like more of a streety wear look. So I'll piece these two together and I'll show you what- Oh my god, stop. You know when you just didn't know you needed something in your life? And then it arrives and you're like, how have I not had you in my life forever? Like, oh, I need to do like full length things so you can see how good the flies look. Oh my god, so, um, let me come a bit closer. So, when I was putting them on, I was like, hello, where's the string? Like, I need to, you know, tie it. But it's so like, it's one of them where it just grabs you. So even if you were a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller, it would just like grab you like where you are. And like, this is the perfect crop for, oh, oh my God, this as well. So I got size small. I would definitely say small's probably gonna be like your six to 10 range. The, to be fair, like I was worried that like my thighs were gonna be, because I wanted it to look baggy. And I didn't know if my thighs were gonna be like touching the sides, but it, actually they are really baggy, so they look good, they look baggy. So if you want them to look baggy and you are a size like 12, I'd say 12 could either get medium or small, depending how you want it to fit. But I would go like size up if you want the these to look baggy. So I just didn't know I needed it in my life and now I'm gonna wear it every single day. <laughs> I need to show you the um, bottom. Excuse the unprofessionalism, but I just wanted to show you guys the bottom. They're so good with some chunky trainers. <laughs> Next item. So I've been wanting a leather jacket, like blazer jacket for so long. I've got a black one. I've got a checked one. I've got like, I've got a lot of blazers. I've got a nude one and my family like, you don't need more blazers, but I didn't have a leather one. And I just have sort of seen so many like Pinterest looks with the leather jack like uh, blazer jacket. And I'm like, oh, I need that in my life. So I got a belted one because I just thought you can style it belted or just wear it like open, like a big baggy one. I'm normally a size eight on top. I did go size 12 in this because when I've seen like other YouTubers and other influencers, they always say size up to get that baggy effect. Um, so I haven't tried it on. I might have completely messed up by going up, but we'll see. Um, because it did say oversized anyway, so it was already an oversized, so we'll see. So this is just, it comes with like a plain leather belt, so I just thought this would be great to style with other things and the blazer as well. Um, but I probably will mainly just wear the blazer open, but we'll see. So let's have a look. So as I say, I got size 12. I haven't seen this yet, I'm excited. Ooh, oh, I love the fact that it's like a double-breasted button. I just think that makes it look so much more expensive than what it actually is. Oh, I'm excited. I feel like it looks more boxy with by going up, which is what I wanted in size. Oh, I feel like it's giving me Molly May vibes. Right, amazing. 
I love that. I think the sleeve lengths are really good as well. I haven't obviously tried it on yet, but I've always find, I don't know about you with a lot of blazers, that the sleeve lengths are like too short. I know I have like ridiculously long arms, but, um, oh, I'm excited. Okay, so I'm gonna try it on. Guys, this has pockets. The blazer actually has pockets. So I paired it with the two piece just because I feel like, you know, for like a streetwear vibe with like chunky trainers, body, bag like I can't believe it has pocket I'm so happy I went two sizes up I feel like that it gives me that oversized look that I wanted if I'd have gone a size 8 it would have just looked like a normal tight blazer which wasn't the look I was wanting so if you wanted more of that like oversized look I'd definitely go bigger in size the art uh, the sleeve length is perfect maybe that's because I've gone up a size as well I'm not sure because normally when I wear a size 8 the sleeves are like here like I said I've got long arms but and it looks like a nice leather as well. It doesn't look like a cheap leather. Like, I love the fact that it's the four buttons. I think it just makes it look so much more expensive. I probably will never wear it done up, but I'm so impressed. I just didn't know I needed, I can't believe it's got pockets. It's just made my day. <laughs> oh my God, you have to buy. So there's a leather theme here. Um, so the next item is a pair of leather trousers. So I don't have a pair of skinny black jeans because I tried getting some for my birthday and I'm just like an awkward length in, in legs. So normally Pretty Little Thing is really good and size eight are long enough and they do trousers long enough for me. So I got them from there. They were too short, like really short. And even like at the minute I've got Bershka jeans and they're just too short for me. So I can't wear them. And I just feel like a pair of black skinny trousers in your wardrobe, you just need to like pair with things. So then I ended up getting the tall and then they were ridiculously tall for me. So I'm just praying, these aren't jeans because obviously I just feel like I'm not finding jeans that fit me. So what I did was I got a pair of black skinny leather trousers that like have a bit of a slit slash flare. I don't know if you can see at the end because then that might just you know give away from the fact that they might be a bit short i mean i don't know they might be long enough to be fair i might have like just been needing boohoo in my life all this time so i got a size eight in these i'm a little bit nervous about size eight because i am definitely eight ten i don't like depending on brands like i can be a 10 to 12 so on bottom so we'll see um so i'm a bit nervous about the eight i think it'll suck me in i don't know if i'll feel com com Confident, but I'm gonna give it a go. I feel like with skinny trousers, you want them to look skinny, and that's why I went for the eight because you don't want them to look like gape off you. Um, so they actually look really long, so I'm buzzing about that. I hope they look good because I need a black pair of skinny trousers. So I'll try them on, guys. These leather trousers they're a size eight, and I was petrified I was gonna feel because some size eights I put them on, and I'm like, I feel like I'm like over bulging out. They're like they don't feel too loose and they definitely don't feel like they're suffocating me. I just can't believe my look. Oh my god, boohoo is my new favorite. And look, they're even slightly a bit too long, but I think that's because when you're wearing like your, your chunky boots or heels, like it gives it a little bit so it doesn't look like they're too sh I can't believe it. I can't believe I finally got a pair of black skinny trousers. <laughs> I'm so excited. Some leather, like fake leather, can like not compliment you and it like hugs in all the wrong places but I really feel like this is like complimentary and like even though it's tight it doesn't look ridiculously tight I know I'm not making sense but I'm really happy with this because I feel so conscious in like skinny trousers sometimes but this is just like oh. so a lot of people on my TikTok were asking me how to style an uh, oversized shirt. And I do have a few like shackets, but I didn't have like a proper oversized shirt. Um, and I like giving you guys what you want, so I got an oversized shirt. Um, this, I'm excited. I honestly, on the website, thought it was just black and white, but it's come. And it's like blue, black and white. Which I would have never ordered if I knew it was blue, but now it's arrived. I'm actually really glad because I always feel like I just wear black and white. I don't have a lot of colour in my wardrobe. And I feel like the blue just makes it that little bit edgier. Um, so, like I said, it's a proper oversized shirt. I got it in a size 12. I swear I ordered an 8, you know. Maybe they're doing me a favour because it's actually supposed to be worn. I could wear this now as like a dress or a shirt or a... 
Okay, I'm gonna try this on. I never would have ordered a size 12. Thank you for making a mistake, Boohoo, because I feel like you just changed my wardrobe. Right, so this is the size 12 shirt that I actually ordered in an eight, but I feel like I'm gonna be like secretly thanking Boohoo for this one. So I'm gonna just chuck it on with these trousers because I was thinking how I would want to style it is with like black skinny, like all black outfit with this as the statement, wear it open, maybe add a belt, crossbody and things like that. So we'll see how it looks, but I feel like I could even get away with this as a dress now, maybe? With it being... Oh, look at that. I feel like maybe an 8 would have just not had the oversized look that I was wanting, because I was wanting to wear it like... You know what I mean? Like, street style. I feel like this is a lot more like the Pinterests I've been seeing as well. So I feel like, because at the minute, isn't it like your dad's shirt is in fashion? So it's... Oh my god. Thank you, boohoo. Because otherwise it would have probably just been like a normal shirt, which isn't what I wanted at all. I feel like they just secretly knew that this girl just doesn't know what she's doing. And I feel like this is a cute little outfit. Add a little bag, add some chain. I really like it. I have been wanting a long puffer white coat for the whole of autumn. And I just was like, I'm getting one. So... I'm buzzing about this. I'm stuck. Right, let's. The inside of the hood is fur. Oh my god, that feels so soft. So, let's have a look. I'm in love. Uh, I actually love the contrast of the black and white. I thought I would want all white, but I love this. And the fact that it's got black inside the hood as well, I just feel like you could make that look real. I cannot wait to try this on. So I would say it's like a sh one of those like shiny materials. Um, I got it in a size eight. Um, I'll just try and show you a better. I love the pockets as well. Ooh, it's like contrast to the here as well. Ooh, for healing it. I like I like the fact that it's the contrast. So we'll see. And then the inside of it is just plain black. So I will try this on for you. And we'll see. Guys, this is the moment I have been waiting for. I have wanted a coat like this all, like all, all autumn. So I just pray it looks good. Oh. Oh my God. Oh my God, the pockets are at the perfect. Oh, I mean, come on. I'm just vibing right now, sorry. You're literally getting my immediate reaction, so. And I feel like this is true to size. Like, don't mean to size up or go down. Like, I would have ordered, always ordered a size eight. This is a size eight, and I feel like it fits perfect. I wouldn't have wanted it to be too baggy or too tight. I mean, I never would zip it up, but we'll see what it looks like. Yeah, so this is like a really good fit. So I would just go with the true size on this one. Um. Comment below if you want to see like a TikTok on like how I style the coat of different outfits. Because I know sometimes when you're planning your outfit, I know I can suddenly get all like, oh, but it won't go with the coat. And like, how do I get the coat into the outfit? So if you do want to see how I style this, because I know a lot of people have got white coats this autumn. So if you're not knowing how to style it, let me know. It is like that shiny material, but I quite like it because it is the whole point of being the puffer. Um, and I like that it's not too overly like puffy. But then it's not like tiny little puffs, so it doesn't. No. I love. So that's the Boohoo haul. Comment below what you think. Make sure you subscribe um, because the videos are going to keep coming. And the next video is a very, very good special one. So I'm so excited to share. So um, let me know what you think. Let me know if you want any TikTok like styling videos. Um, that I can do, I'll definitely do the shirt. I'm actually so thankful to Boohoo for that. Um, and actually, I'm in love with everything, like, but I actually feel like these have saved me because now I have a pair of black skinny trousers. Oh my God. I feel like Boohoo's just nearly gone up to like my favorite shop. <laughs> right, love you all and thank you for watching.